All right, we're live at Pace Studio. We're here with Jackie Green, who's going to play us a few songs this afternoon. And why don't we go right in and have you tell us a little bit about the first one. Okay, sure. Uh, this song is a song off of my latest album, uh, which is still about a year old at this point. Um, and the song is called Trust Somebody. Um, and it's about, well, it's about a lot of things, but um, it's... Is basically a love song to, for for someone who may have uh, lost love or is in a, is in sort of a tough place. It's that kind of a song. Yeah, whenever you're it. ready. This is a beautiful place, and I wish everybody on Facebook could see this. All this, this cool stuff around here. Don't you weep Take your blankets from the floor Let your baby sleep She don't live here no more You think you're drifting deep But there's a light upon the shore You just get tired sometimes It's heavy on your mind Did somebody hurt you? Did somebody lie? Maybe they desert you, but they killed themselves inside. No matter how it goes down, you can still stand up with pride. You just get tired sometimes. You just get tired. In the middle of the night time, in the freezing rain, I heard somebody asking, was it all worth the pain? But I believe that your darkness could never move your light. But when you're blinded, you're reminded of all that's wrong in life. Now when you're out of your mind, broken and blind, to turn it around, you've got to trust somebody. Look at yourself, do you like what you see? If you want something else, you've got to trust somebody. I ain't no one but a stranger to you. But I will show you what love can do, yeah. Whoa. Some got loving by the hour, some got loving by the pound. But I will love you for a lifetime, and I'll never let you down. Cause you know the truth is, we all go round and round. We just get tired sometimes. We just get tired. I don't know about you, but sometimes I feel like it's a crime To suffer through the motions, one heartache at a time But I can tell that you still got it By the look that's in your eyes You think it's missing, but I'm guessing It's been there all the time Now when you're out of your mind Broken and blind To turn it around you got to trust somebody Look at yourself Do you like what you see? If you want something else you got to trust somebody I ain't no one But a stranger to you but I will show you What love can do Yeah Oh yeah How would you know That you're alive Until you've died a thousand times Cause even fools like me are 
wise enough to say you will have everything when you give everything away and now I'm out of my mind broken and blind turn it around I've got to trust somebody look at myself I don't like what I see I want something else so I can trust somebody Sounded great. This is so weird. <laughs> Why is it weird? I don't know. I've just never done this before. We're going out live on the internet. Yeah, it's the I'm new way, it. way of the future. I thought that when you guys first talked about this, I thought I was going to be like having the computer here and I was going to be like <laughs> fumbling with the webcam. <laughs> this is actually a lot easier, so thanks. Yeah, Maybe you're welcome. We, we try to make things comfortable for our guests. Right. So let us I'm worry about the, the heavy lifting. In this room. <laughs> What's that? I might be the oldest person in this room. Right Later we'll go around compare ages. <laughs> um, so, will you, so speaking of years, you released Back to Birth, your last album, as you were saying, like a year and change ago. And I read that you're currently working on something new uh, for am, your new yeah. label. I am working on something new. Um, well, to, what, well, if to, anything, to can you tell us I'm about I'm always it. sort of working on something new, but um, I do have... Uh, some plans to put out hopefully a couple things this year um, at the very least an EP um, maybe a whole record as well as um, a live thing so um, look for that probably in the probably in the summer I would guess spring or summer cool uh, will you tell us about the next song you're gonna do sure uh, I hadn't really thought about it but I figure I'll do since you guys brought a piano in here which is sweet um, we might as well use it. I'm going to do a song of mine called Hallelujah. There's a million songs called Hallelujah, but this one is, this one's mine. Um, and it, to me, it's just, I wrote it after my dad died. And, uh, it's, I guess in my mind, it's, um, I don't know. It's not, I don't know if I, I would want to take it super religiously, but it's, I don't know. I guess it's left up to the listener really, but uh, I sort of wrote it for my dad after my dad died. Eventually, 
gospel rave up ending to it but i kind of need the band for that oh uh, yeah well well it sounded great over here <laughs> um well so you've kind of made a career of working with a lot of different musicians like you've toured with people like phil lesh mm -hmm. and uh, the black crows and um i imagine just over the course of that over so many years of um, being on the road and working with so many other collaborative musicians you've probably met a lot of a lot of just fellow musicians mm -hmm. both in those circles and then outside of those circles do you have a favorite person that you've either met or worked with like like an idol or someone who you always oh, wanted to connect with <laughs> um, no I wouldn't say that I have a favorite I mean like everybody you know people are individuals you know and so are so obviously so so are musicians given that they're individuals and um, I think you know I learned something from all those experiences that you mentioned, I've def I've learned or I've tried my best to absorb uh, what I can from those. Like you, like you said, playing with the Black Crows is um, that was a big deal for me because um, it was a situation where I got to got to basically play really loud rock and roll guitar in one of my favorite bands of, of all time, and uh, you know, a band that I grew up listening to, and um, that the, sort of to have that be my job in that band. You know, I wasn't you know I was just playing guitar, I wasn't singing, so. Um, I really could focus on, you know, on, on rock and roll guitar playing. And I think uh, I became a better guitar player for that. And similarly with, you know, like you mentioned, uh, say Phil Lesh and Friends and playing with Bob Weir and, and all the Grateful Dead guys, um, that really, I mean, I still do that to this, I still play with those guys. And it's like the, the way they um, approach live performance is so unique uh, that... You know, when I first started doing it, I was a little bit, I was a little afraid. I was like, oh, you know, f can we really do that? And the thing about Phil is he's so fearless in, um, in his approach to, to live performance that he's willing to try just about anything. And, you know, sometimes you fall flat on your face and, some, and sometimes you don't. And the, and the times that you don't, there's a, there's a weird sort of magical thing that happens with all the players on stage and that you can't really replicate without taking that leap, you know, without putting yourself out there musically like that. And... Um, that's something that that I really that I enjoy and that I I didn't enjoy at first I enjoy now take it took me a while to um sort of get that concept but um there's a yeah I mean there's a there's a definite spirit there that 
that rubs off on 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 myself for sure. Speaking of guitar, um, I heard you're gonna switch up your instruments a yeah, bit I was gonna and play your next a, one on guitar. I have a Marshall stack. I was gonna bring it in here. My hundred watt amp. I was gonna no. We're gonna use one of the guitars you guys got in here. You wanna switch it up? Yeah, let's switch change it up. Positions. Switch it up. Camera change. All right. Ugh. Oh wait, I need my harmonica. Watching you. <laughs> As you get set up, will you tell us about the third song you're gonna do? Sure. Um, this is also a song off of the, off the record. This is called "Silver Lining." Um, it's a song. In my mind, it's it's just about um, you know as I've gotten a little older, sort of being content with your place in the food chain, uh, as it were, or the world, um, and sort of uh, I guess in some ways being being grateful. You know, um, sounds a little cheesy, but in my mind, that's sort of what it's about. And I'm going to try it a little bit higher than the record and see if my voice will do it. Let's check. Shine your light way 
I guess he's lonely too Or maybe he's preaching out loud All the truth that I already know Life ain't never fair It's like that everywhere Where's my silver lining? I've been dying, dying to see. But every day I'm finding that silver lining. Great. Thank you. So uh, I see you'll be in town again on the 3rd, right? Uh, well, you're going to be playing live, that is, uh, in yeah, New York. Yeah, live for real. Oh, wait, this is live. This is live. This is about as live as it gets, For really. more, For more people, yeah. I guess. Uh, well, where can well, we see you? Well, it depends. I mean, what do you <laughs> more people, but <laughs> where, more, where, more, more flesh and blood people. <laughs> where, where can we see you again? Uh, well, we, t- we tour all the time. We tour all over. We've got a big, we've got a long tour coming up. Um, let's see, I guess in February, second week of February, we're at, uh, I'm doing a thing uh, called Voodoo Dead, um, which will take place at Irving Plaza. Um, let's see. Then we've got, I mean, we play all over. We've got a big tour coming up in end of March, all through April. You can check our website for, for dates. Um, and you'll I mean, be we're, you know, we do 150 shows a year, so it's hard to... But hard you'll to be work. at Le Poison Rouge uh, in a couple days, right? Oh, right. Third? God, yeah, that's like tomorrow, right? Or the, the day after tomorrow. That's <laughs> after that's tomorrow. another sort of fun thing thing like this. Um, yeah, what, what's the place called again? The, Le Poison Rouge? Yeah, I can't say that. It's French. Um, <laughs> it took me a long time to learn <laughs> yeah, right. how to say it. I don't want to say something Now I say it bad. all the time. <laughs> um, Cool. Yeah, so we're doing. I'm doing that. That'll be fun. It's that'll be different. We're going to be talking about spirituality and as it relates to uh, to music. Um, and hopefully, I won't get too carried away and start talking about random stuff. But you never know. Might play a couple songs. So everybody's invited to come to that. That should be fun. Um, awesome. Cool. Well, we want to thank you again for being here. Absolutely. With us. This is fun. This is um, this is great. Now that I live in New York, I can come do these fun things. Well, you're welcome to come back anytime. Cool. Thank you. <laughs>